King Arthur and the Knights of the Round Table. Chapter 5. Vivian and Merlin. When King Arthur was a young man, Merlin, the man of magic, helped him in every way. He taught him to be a good king and a brave knight. Merlin helped Arthur to be king to everybody in his country, so they all loved him. With Merlin's help, Arthur built the beautiful city, Camelot. Camelot had roads and houses and a great castle. Later, when Merlin was an old man, he came to King Arthur again. I have to say goodbye now, said Merlin. Goodbye? Why, Merlin? asked King Arthur. I'm going to die, Merlin told him. I will not always be here. In the future, when you will make mistakes, my magic wouldn't help you. Oh, Merlin, said King Arthur sadly. I don't want you to go. I'm going down into a dark cave and I cannot come back from that cave. But Merlin, King Arthur cried, you know a lot of magic. Can you not stop this? Do you have to die? I cannot stop it, answered Merlin. You have to be a strong king without me now. After Merlin spoke to King Arthur, Lady Vivian came to Camelot. Before this time, she lived with the Lady of the Lake. The Lady of the Lake made Excalibur and she knew a lot of magic. Vivian learned magic from the Lady of the Lake. Then she went to Camelot and studied with Merlin. When she knew all Merlin's magic, she thought, He is an old man. I cannot kill him because his magic is strong. But I can send him away somewhere so he can't come back. Then I will have the greatest and strongest magic in the world. Vivian went on a long journey with Merlin to another country. They climbed in a high grey mountain and came to a dark place with a lot of trees and a small river. There they saw a magic cave inside the mountain. The mouth of the cave is open now, said Merlin to Vivian. When you say the magic word, the mouth of the cave will shut. I know this magic word, but which words will open it again? asked Vivian. I don't know, said Merlin. I want to look inside the cave, Vivian said. Please come with me, show me the way. So... Merlin went into the cave first. Vivian ran out quickly. She shouted the magic words and the mouth of the cave shut loudly. Merlin was inside and couldn't get out. Some people say that the great Merlin is there now, inside the cave. One day they say somebody will break open the big stone door of the cave. Then Merlin will come out again and help the world with his magic. He will, they say, teach everybody to be good and happy. But after that sad day, King Arthur had no help from his friend Merlin.